With the threat of an escalating trade war between China and the U.S., Beijing used this meeting with the European Union to push free trade. President Xi Jinping hailed globalization as he met with European Council President Donald Tusk and Commission President Jean-Claude Juncker on Monday. China and the EU said their relationship is more important than ever, especially in light of the conflict between the world's two largest economies. Premier Li Keqiang expressed China's commitment to fair trade practices and plans to open up its economy further to foreign investors. Let me repeat, as long as you are registered here in China, you will be treated the same as Chinese companies. We forbid any forced transfer of intellectual property and will deal with IP violations in a more serious manner. For those who violate intellectual property laws, we will punish them to the fullest extent of the law so that they cannot afford to commit such violations again. As pressure builds between Washington and Beijing, Europe played peacemaker, saying there's still time to prevent conflict and chaos. Heads of both the European Commission and European Council called on China and the U.S. to mend ties before the situation gets worse. It is a common duty of Europe and China, America and Russia, not to destroy this order but to improve it, not to start trade wars which turned into hot conflict so often in our history. The meeting produced a communique, both sides affirming their commitment to multilateral trading. Both sides also agreed that trade disputes should be addressed through the World Trade Organization and set up a joint working group to discuss WTO reform. The conversation didn't stop at trade. Both sides also reiterated their commitment to the Paris Climate Change Pact and pledged more cooperation in global humanitarian assistance. Audrey Seek, CGTN.